Humane Society of the United States, along with several organizations. In closing, I do not agree that there are more important issues in the city right now. Patrons, citizens, and taxpayers, um, organizations, which they will state, um, the souls of young children, which will be read a letter, are being victimized by unlawful and ethical profiteers of animal cruelty in our city. It is time for the city to step in and take responsibility in a role in protecting the citizens and its children. Thank you for your time, and we are looking forward to hearing from you. Thank you, Kelly. that mass produce dogs for resale in pet stores. And over the years, uh, because the conditions at most of these places are so bad, it has come to apply to any bad breeder. Bob Baker filmed this undercover footage. Over more than a quarter of a century, he has visited upwards of a thousand large-scale commercial breeding kennels, often discovering shockingly bad standards. The breeders consider that their dogs is nothing other than puppy producing machines. They're there to turn a profit for them. They're just bred incessantly in, in horrendous conditions. And as soon as they don't come in the heat regularly, they take them out and shoot them. They're disposable. Homicides, a lot of suicides, a lot of deaths. I've seen a lot of things, but I have never seen anything quite like this. See? 
industry in the world that is as cruel as my industry. You can't see the tears. They had in the um, I just urge you to look into this matter. Um, it's not responsible to be supplying our citizens or our patrons with uh, these sick, maladapted animals. It's cruel, and um, I just urge you to look into this matter for us. Thank you. Thank you for your comment. Do we have any other public comments? Hands for children. And you know that the little lives can become such a mess. Hell. Hands for children. And you should not to pay for your love with your bones and your flesh. Black in your eyes and then